Hey! What's up, guys? It's the Normies coming at you with a little bit of Mandalorian. I believe it's episode 7, called Chapter 7, until the episode starts and then it tells us the title of the episode. <gasps> it's Chapter 8. Chapter Yo, 8. Previously last, on the Mando. <laughs> last episode was lit. I don't know. Remember how like that alien girl looks so familiar? Yeah, apparently. Yeah, it's Asha! Tonks. Tonks from I Air can't Water. believe that. Or Asha. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She looks, she they did a good job with the makeup. Uh, yeah. I, I could, like, the voice, I was just like, I heard this before. I know. Like, her so little, like, <laughs> like, the way she's like, hey. She's good at being a weirdo. Yeah. Kind of the only character she plays. <laughs> also, Bill Burr did a fantastic job. Of yeah, he did. Being of that sucking. <laughs> did you he see Sean funny. Tank Top has one of the little Bill Burr toys? Uh-uh. Yeah, he's got, like, the little tiny action figure. That's hilarious. There's a yeah. Bill Burr action figure. I mean, no, from the show. What? Yeah. Funny. That's hilarious. It's got the little gun Where's in the back baby gun. Oats? Ooh, where's our baby Oats? I just love it. like, I'm not a fucking storm. Oh, where's our baby Oats? Where's our baby Oats? We just got them yesterday. Oh, I saw you messing with them over there. Oh, shit. Our little thingies. I'm going to get up baby again. Oats. No, 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 no. Just tell me where it's at. I'll get it. It's in, right uh, there behind the paper towel. Yeah. Look at that. One of our fans, his name goes by, and he goes by the name Wan Shi Tong. And, uh, he, knows he knows a thousand things. He's got an Instagram, I believe. But, I mean, if not, then whoops. But he made us custom. Star Wars Legos that he painted himself. Among them is the Mandalorian and, and the Baby Yodes in a potato sack. Baby, the baby, baby, baby. the baby. Oh, Ma- Mando. We can, here's uh, Mando with the with the red vest. Can we throw him on there? Mando, Mando, Mando. If he doesn't fit, this is just one of the uh, the other Mandalorians. Oh no! You dropped the baby like in the last you episode. Dro- oh my god! Stop the baby. Guys, we had my birthday at the studio, and people were just playing with these lightsabers the whole time, just fighting with each other. They were having a lot of fun. Side note. What's up, boy? Thank you, JJ Joe Max. Thanks, JJ and Joe Max. It's my favorite birthday present. It's one of my faves. I get to fuck around with it. And I get jealous when other people touch it. Yeah, me too. It was uh, like sitting here on the couch all like lopsided, and I'm like, who the fuck? Who been playing with my saber? This is not a market substitute. Watch the real Mando on your own. Support him, because he needs your support in order to feed his baby Yoda. Also, also, give me my phone. Uh, if you want to, you can support the Normies over on Patreon, where you can watch uncut, and on certain TV shows, you can watch ahead, depending on if the TV show hours are already. Also, supporting us on Patreon allows us to do fun things like skits and podcasts, gaming channel, cooking show, all those things, all because of viewers like things. you. Now, let's get it. Let's get it. Use the force to press play. Press play. Play. It's the, no, it's the play button. So, do you think like the plastic on their uniforms just melts to their bodies when they get the flamethrower hit? Fuck, that would, oh, that would suck so bad. you think there'd be more blood-curdling screams where they just kind of fall over. Yeah. I think they're just, like, they're so speechless as what's happening to them. Like, like, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. I want that ship. You have to steal it from them. I like that Baby Yoda looks like an old man and a baby at the same time. <laughs> My friend. If you are receiving this transmission, that means you are alive. You might be surprised to hear this, but I am alive too. <laughs> I guess we can call it even. The man who hired you is still here, and his ranks of ex-Imperial guards have grown. If you would consider one last commission, I will very much make it worth your while. No, I don't trust no, you. Fuck you. If you succeed, you keep the child, and I will have your name cleared with the guild. For a man of honor should not be forced to live in exile. I await your arrival with optimism. What are you gonna do? Uh, sounds too good to be true, man. It does, yeah. but if they go for he the should, old double cross. You should get his Mando, Mando people. Oh, oh hey. yeah, nice. He's crewing up, bro. She's She's gonna be like, Mando, you son of a bitch, I'm in. <laughs> You have to ball tap yourself, tap out. They're providing the plan and firepower. I'm the snare. Don't they kid? That's why I'm coming to you. I don't know. I've been advised to lay low. And I'm not in the mood to play soldier anymore. Especially fighting some local warlord. He's not a local warlord. He's imperial. I'm in. <laughs> <laughs> son of a bitch. I feel like that line was in there and they had to take it out after the fucking Morty episode here. You trust the contact? Not particularly. And I had a run-in last time I was there on some guild business. So then why are we going? I don't have a choice. You 
saw what happened on Sorghum. They'll keep sending hunters. The kid will never be safe until the imp is oh dead. My... <laughs> like, what can we do with him now? Put him upside down. Is he eavesdropping? Is he driving? Oh, no. Oh, he is driving. He heard them? Yeah. He does not want to go back. Maybe he feels that it's a, it's a cross. It's a trap. I would use the baby's judgment on this. You got anyone you can trust? Yep. Damn, he's going back to all the planets. He's picking up motherfuckers. He's like, bro, I need you as a babysitter, dad. Oh, this is awesome. That's why we saw Nick Nolte again. Nick all right, Nolte. I spoke. Oh, you don't even have to say anything. Baby. But, so, hey, did we figure out who the tracker's on? Is it on the baby? It has been oh, no. Maybe. I think it might be a strand cast. I don't think it was engineered. I've worked Strand in cast. the gene farms. This one looks evolved. Too ugly. What? How is it ugly? Hey! Hey, uh, I He fixed them. Would anyone yes. care for some tea? Please, lower your blast. He will not harm you. That thing is programmed to kill the baby. Not anymore. See, Mando, you can reprogram droids. I recovered the flotsam and staked it as my own in accordance with the charter of the New Republic. Hmm. Reconstruction was quite difficult, but not impossible. Dude, that thing is a killing machine. You need it on your side what? for this mission. It had to learn everything Aww. from scratch. Oh. This is something that cannot be taught with a twist of a spanner. It developed a personality as it experiences grew. A solid droid montage. It's a droid touch. No. <laughs> Damn. That is freaking awesome. This is still a hunter. No, but it will protect. She protects. <laughs> <Come on. laughs> The most intense stare down from things that don't have eyes. Right. <laughs> I want to hire your services. I am retired from service. I can reprogram my J11 for nursing and protocol. No. I don't want that droid anywhere near him. Do you trust me? From what I can tell, yes. Then you will trust my work. Damn. My G11 will join me. And we do it not for payment. But to protect the child from imperial slavery. None will be free until the old ways are gone. I mean, he said nothing was left. Or not much was left, so okay. we'll see. Can they activate the formula? The blurgs will join me as well. Like maybe there's the some blurgs? I have spoken. <laughs> oh, how are you going to fit them on the ship? <laughs> Multiple of them? Yeah, I guess. It's cool because now IG-88 might have an arc where it needs to relearn how much of a badass it used to be. Like in that first episode. Oh, he doesn't want to go. Is he using the force? He's gonna help them. What is he doing? Oh. No. Oh, no, 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 no. Not he's choking her. Consent. Because he, think, he thinks they're fighting. I've heard rumors of it. What? When you work for the Empire? When I was sold to the Empire. In indentured servitude. Yet somehow we walk free. Do not cast doubt upon that of what I am, nor whom I shall serve. Back up, IG. All right, Quill. I don't like how close the droid is getting. Under no circumstances does that thing leave the ship. You got a real thing for droids, don't you? I got a real thing for that droid. But Ugnaught said he rewired it. That droid was designed to kill things. I don't care how much wiring he replaced it goes against its nature but it's code isn't it yeah but i don't know you know it's like the humans change who they're born into can droids i mean but droids have like code like i can just delete it all and put new in ain't it we're trying to start calling baby yoda the child it's just hard everybody on the internet like it's I, we all know it's not yoda but fuck man it's like nomenclature yeah, dictates i don't give a shit i'm gonna call him baby yoda he's the child Precious little creature. I can see why you didn't 
want to harm a hair on his wrinkled little head. <laughs> his nose is so small. The sun drops fast on Navarro. We can walk through a spell and camp out at the riverbank and make our way into town at first light. I'd rather stay by the shit. But who's gonna eat, eat the shit? The droid? The droid, yeah. I mean, he can watch the shit. <laughs> but he's not programmed to defend himself. They said he'll protect. He's programmed to protect. And he'll shoot protect. any Jawas on sight. Oh. I'm gonna get you a That's shirt that says down with Jawas. Also, if they what trespass the on your land, you'll Is kill them. Is that a goat? Goat dog. I ain't trying to do is spend a whole episode getting my shit back from them. To negotiate a deal for shit that I already own. Never seen anything like it. They were ready to pay King's what ransom for that thing. Must be for some kind of highfalutin menagerie. What? <laughs> Come again? <laughs> highfalutin. Menagerie. 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 Was it? Trust me. Mm. Nothing can go wrong. <laughs> the fuck was that? What the fuck was that? It's the baby. It's the baby. What a fucking pterodactyl. Close the lid. Steal the baby. Oh. I'm guessing that's a no. He's gonna heal him. He's trying to eat me. Yeah. <laughs> Shut the fuck up, Grief. That's caught right there. <laughs> yep. <laughs> what the? Speak about it. They only have one. You're talking about it now. Grief. Lord, they just saved your life. I swear to God, if you're a double cross. Lord, he lost all his friends. I know. That sucks, man. <laughs> He's trying to eat me. Those I'm are your really, last words. I'm glad Mando's got some friends on this one because this is about to be. I don't know what's gonna happen. <laughs> yes, this is it. If you double cross their asses, I swear to God. What? Nice. Oh, he changed his mind. I was about to say. He was gonna. Yep. Yeah. You should know. No yeah. shit. Thank you, the child. Yes. The Imperial client is obsessed with obtaining this asset. You tried to run, but where did it get you? This is ridiculous. Perhaps you should let him speak. Listen, <laughs> we both All about need speaking. the client to be eliminated. Let me take the child to him, and then you do. No. The kid the goes back and not go. Without the child, none of this works. I have a plan. Quill, ride back to the Razor Crest with the child and seal yourself in. When you're inside, engage ground security protocols. Nothing on this planet will breach those doors. Damn. The Razor Crest is dope. Oh my Grief. Grief, I'm glad you came through instead Yo, of being. Oh, this is getting exciting, ass. bro. This show is so good. And that's the last time they ever saw each other. Man, I'm still kind of tripping that he like tried to force choke fucking. God, this fucking so drop trooper. You see his face all scrunched up. That was like a redux of the Mando theme. It was so good. Here we are. I would like to see the baby. Ah, uh, it is asleep. We all will be quiet. <laughs> 
Fuck, because he's out by the Razor Crest. What the fuck? But that droid. Who's shooting from outside? No idea. Fucking Los Pollos Hermanos. Fucking OK Corral. Like, who is shooting? What just happened? Purge Troopers? Uh, you guys called wait. Death oh, Troopers? No! Oh, I thought it looked shit. like Mandos. No. Shit. They're from, like, the new Imperial the one that's from the... Oh, oh shit. Uh, why'd they just off everybody in there? Is Werner Herzog dead? <laughs> They're all shitty shots, though. It's fine. Except black, for the black these ones. black ones, yeah. Oh, Damn. This is bad. Get the kid out of here. We're pinned down. Go faster, Blurgy. Oh, my blurred. Well, shit. shit. Gus was the guy that was standing over dead. Uh, Wan for sure. Yeah. Fennec. Holy shit. You have something I want. Who's this guy? <laughs> you may think you have some idea what you are in possession of, but you do not. Some serious armor he's got. Quill, are you back to the ship yet? They're on to us. <laughs> IG, IG-11 is there to protect. Quill, do you copy? Quill. No, no. Means more to me than you will ever know. Quill, are you there? Come in, Quill. Quill, what come in. Fuck? What? Oh, man. If I'm Quill. No! Are you serious? No! That's the first cliffhanger on the show! Fuck you, John Favreau! There's only two more episodes! No, oh, no. Oh, that's cool. No. Storyboard. Yo. Damn. I was. Oh, man. Man, this was. Man, that sucks. Quill was. Man, we only had him for one more episode. Quill and all the blurbs. He hath spoken his last speech. Damn. Man, uh, it's. I gotta love his voice, though. I love how they just drew him as. as <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, Giancarlo Esposito. They knew he was gonna be played by him. No. Man, this felt like a real, like, it felt like a, a New Hope-ish, kind of, when they're all on the ship, kind of yeah. distrusting each other, like, Mandor doesn't trust the droid, uh, what's his name? Nick Nolte, I, I always forget his name. God damn. He didn't trust Kara. Yeah. Man, no, nah, this was fuck. Maybe one. he's not dead, maybe he just got shot in the back and injured, and uh, IG-88 will come rescue him. And rescue Hopefully, him man. God, believe that. I don't know. That was, that was intense, man. Shit, what are they gonna do? I, I think the chips might be down for him the next yeah, episode. Yeah, you hear Mando's voice on the, and he's like, Quill? 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 Are you there? Like, you're worrisome. Well, that was a... How you gonna leave us like that? No, after so many well, neat resolutions episode. every week, and now they're gonna leave us dying. They prepared us for this. They were like, ah, oh. ah, resolution, resolution, resolution. Nada. And we're like, ah! They snatched the child. The baby. Don't touch the child. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I oh. can't remember what, but my niece watches a YouTube video where the guy's catchphrase is, don't touch the child. <laughs> sort of, I don't know. Oh. Uh -huh. we, we included the Jawa for Jawa Inclusion Day. Man, why are we including the Jawa? Oh, fuck, man. I don't know what's going to I'm sad. I don't know what's going to happen. We're going to Christmas like this. How could you do this to us? Oh no, when are we watching the next one? Oh. On Friday, next Friday. Yeah, are you going to be here? here? Yeah, yeah, I'll be back. Okay. 
But you're not Rona's gonna be there. Gonna be. No. Oh, I, I you're quill. I'll be there. If, you're quill. You're <laughs> I'll be there in, in, in spirit with the force. So, so you have spoken. I've spoken. Oh no. Oh, We're gonna no. have a FaceTime on an iPad and right yeah, here. Yeah, I'll be right there. I'll be. I'll be. I'll be a droid. <laughs> You wanna you wanna try that experimental reaction? Yeah. The remote. We should try it. <laughs> See if you could sync up and then just like FaceTime in. I'm sad. Man, fuck that was alright. So this is a good episode. I was also getting, and I know that this isn't the case, but a whole bunch of like people from different tribes all on one ship was giving me like fucking uh, Avatar vibes, like they're all on Appa, but Appa's the Razor Crest uh-huh. and and somehow Aang's Yoda. But still, <laughs> I like I just like the discord among the team, except like and then they all just like came together for this child, you know. Yeah. Trying to do what was right by him. And, oh, uh, man, he was using the Force a lot this episode. Yeah. It was, man. He probably was predicting that it was bad news bears to go to that back to that planet. Yeah. And then he was trying to shake the ship. Started uh, force choking Kara coming. without consent. And then he uh, fucking healed he grief. So yeah. Healed yeah. grief, man. That's, that's deep. Is grief dead? Uh, Bernard Herzog dead? Everybody else in that Bernard Bernard Herzog's dead, but Grief, Kara, and Mando are still alive. Oh, yeah, that's right. Grief yeah. was there. Yeah. Bernard Herzog caught it ugly. He was like, I am on the... Fu- I can't do a good Werner Herzog. He's in an episode of Boondocks. That's fucking awesome. But anyways, we, he just got shot up. Like, sh- pew, pew, yeah, straight his, through. His voice. I guess I guess he was in leagues with Gus. Or, with, or what's his name? Yeah. Moff. Uh, Moff. Uh, Moff uh, Grand Moff. Moff. Gar- Moff uh, Gideon. Gideon. Moff Gideon. Gideon. <sighs> Gideon Graves. Little Gideon. Fucking Jeff Sessions. Oh, Man. Awesome. Jeff That's Sessions. That's nice to see him. <laughs> So I, like, I, I rebuke thee. I don't care what you guys say. Baby Yoda <laughs> choking Kara was so Holy cute sh- to me. Who? It was so cute. Who? How Baby Yoda choked her. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, you just like fuck me up, Baby Yoda. No, he's just like, he's just straight. He's like, Ee. Yeah, he's just like, they're arm wrestling, no fighting. Like, <laughs> you ever have a pet that like barks and gets mad and like you start like pretend wrestling? Or yeah. yeah. That's, that's what a good pet should do. Pr- yeah. Protect. He protect. I, I'm okay. sure that IG88 is gonna come in and He's IG do. Now. Even if I don't know, maybe self destruct. Like Rana said a hundred times. Self destruct. Self destruct. Yeah. Damn. I really like Kara. Kara Dune, the shock trooper, the rebel dropper. She's a cool character. She's badass as hell. Yeah. I like how she was like four stormtroopers. Four stormtroopers. As soon as she said four stormtroopers, I was like, "There's no way." No. I was like, "There's just no way that that's true." Four. Like, fuck. It's not true. Yeah. I no. guess. It, Moff just decided Werner Herzog and crew was just expendable and just, just blast everybody in that bar, right. dude. So what Werner Herzog was saying, or um, what's his character's name? I don't actually know his character's name. He just kept calling him Imp. What he was saying about how he was like after, um, you know, he was like, have you seen any peace? Yada, yada, yada. Like when the Empire comes through, there's yeah. peace and there's prosperity and there's this and that. Over and totalitarian it's, rule, though. It, yeah, one, that's it, though. It's like under totalitarian, like fascist rule, but also like the Empire is very... Uh, homogenous with all of its people peoples and not like a lot of like of the aliens and shit so that's like the other thing it's like yeah we'll promise you all these good things but like at what cost like we're gonna well, take your shit you're gonna work for it she'll be indentured servitude like what Nick Nolte's character was saying Quill he was like yeah I was their fucking servant like but it's like it's not it's good. A really a choice or a vote if you have a fucking Death Star aiming at your planet yeah yeah, but at the same time, I guess I know what he means, because, like, you know, the, the Krill planet or whatever, where they say that village is yep. still ravaged by, you know, outside invaders that probably wouldn't have happened under Imperial rule, but again, yeah. Each but a bunch of other time. terrible shit. It's like, it's a transition period, and I mean, like, that's what you're going to have to deal with after there's a revolution, but I do like that they're showing, like, what happens after a resolution, how this power vacuum can lead to, like, other struggling, like, entities fighting and trying to rise to power, trying to be the new big bats, and these motherfuckers hanging on to the shit that they used to believe in, and still being able to use all that to, like, oppress people still, which mm-hmm. is dope. I'm going to really enjoy Mando, uh... Quit shitting on boomers. My parents are boomers. Wow. We're going to really enjoy Mando. Uh... My parents are boomers, too. Oh, my God. Mine are not. Mine aren't. Everybody's <laughs> parents are on <laughs> <laughs> parents are time travelers? Yes. Fucking knew it. Uh, so, there's, so everybody was saying at the movie last night, I went to go see uh, Rise of Skywalker last night, that there was a reference in this movie and that movie of this episode specifically. I think I know what it is, but I'm going to ask everybody. I ain't telling y'all, though. Also, also I would like to make up for my, um, my grievous mistake of assuming that this was not Luke Skywalker's lightsaber. And especially after all the movies I've seen, he does have a different lightsaber for a while. I just apparently forgot when he got it. So that's on me. I thought this was Obi-Wan's. I am a fucking scruffy, scruffy looking nerf herder. That's me. Man, but no, good episode. I was totally agreeing with Quill. How do you say his name? Quill? Quill. Quill. 
week. But he was like telling Karen, like, don't tell me like how to feel kind of thing. Like I spent three of your human lifetimes like making up and like figure out figure out my own way and stuff. I'm like, yeah, you tell her. That's 150 that. years. I yeah. also like how he was telling Mando, like, so droids sad. are not like they they're only like reflections of who imprints on them. Like you know what I mean? They're not good or bad. Yeah. So I don't know, it's I wonder if, like, he's actually dead. Will IG-11 be the, you know, imprint left of his image? Maybe, yeah. Mm -hmm. Like, the last thing he will remember of Quill. Maybe that's why he'll tolerate IG-11. Yeah. Yeah. Damn. It was really funny, though, when Yoda, if Yoda was uh, healing grief, he was like, he's trying to eat me! He's going to eat me. Because he just mentioned he was a carnivore a little bit ago. I... Like, so bad. So can like, we... Mira brushes over him. She's like, he's killing me! Oh, she is, though. So Yoda, the child... Can... He, he knows the ways of the Force and like Destiny. He knows that maybe he knew if he saved this dude well, he, who was morally gray, he would turn on the other two and then they maybe. would have a chance. But. I heard somewhere that uh, all members of that species know how to use the Force. I don't know if that's true or not, but that's what I heard, which would be cool. Maybe they were the first people to ever use the Force. Ooh. I'm sure in some Star Wars lore, they have dived into the first person to have, the, have first the Force. The first Force users. So, oh, yeah. uh, brief internet moment since we're rounding around towards the end of this. Listen. We all know that he is not Baby Yoda. My friend was getting on me about this last night. He's but a child. He's called the child, sure. He's called whatever he wants to be. But, like, that's what the internet's calling. That's just what we're calling him. We all understand it. Yeah. It's just happening. It, it's, it's happening. It's so like, I feel like the more people are getting upset about it, the more it's, like, it gets picked up because it's fun at this point. Just, like, see everybody get worked up. Like, come on. It's just it's nice to call it. It's fun to call him Baby Yoda. Gamatatsu yeah. agrees. Hey guys, I just wanted to watch the show with you. That's literally what he sounds like. That's literally what the voice actor sounds like. It is actually accurate, highly accurate. Whatever happened to my head? Do well, we know what the animals were that attacked your campsite though? Those dragons? Fuck, I was like pter- pterodactyls. Well, they, pterodactyls. Ate, they ate a fucking. Um, a, they ate a couple of the. the, the, the I, I was saying the I blurs. Ate blurs. Yeah. Two yeah. blurs. Two blurs. That's so sad. One of the Those extra goons. Got snatched up. Can you imagine? Can you imagine living on a planet where you're like, oh yeah, you know, we got space travel and high tech shit, and also there's dinosaurs sometimes. Like, <laughs> have you seen Riddick? Or Chronicles of Riddick. Yeah, oh, hell yeah. The, seen Riddick. Kind of look like those things. Those are uh, the one that like, gets up in his face because it's got a blind spot. Yeah. yeah. But whatever, they're needed because Grief would not kill his associates without them. Mm. Well, yeah, he needed to kill two associates because he's got two hands. But the third guy was around some shit with a window. Yeah, where was the third guy? He got eaten. He got oh yeah, he got eaten. It's not. I do like, there's a, this thing in Star Wars where like the technology for us is like years and years ahead, but also it's like in a galaxy long, long ago, far, far away. And so like, it also feels like they're still working with like CRT TVs and like really shit monitors. You know what I mean? Like you look at a ship and you're like, this shit looks old as fuck, but like, it's still like, I don't know. I I, I dig that. That kind of old. Do you think Star Wars would ever jump the shark if they like in the story have been like, oh wait, here's this planet called Earth. Yes. In the Milky Way. Yep. Yeah. Then and everybody's just gonna say it's fucking it's Battlestar Galactica, and, far, far. and it'll be like, well, what the fuck are we doing? Yeah. Because spoilers. I for hear a lot of people are asking that now. Really? After their latest release. You should go see the movie. It's, I, I it's a good it. fucking movie. It, I'm interested. No, you guys don't. Go find me on Discord. Go over our Discord. Tell me what you think about the new movie. I want to know. Yeah. I want to hear it. And no spoilers in the comments, please. No spoilers. I'll delete them. I'll I'll, I'll delete them. I'll be. <laughs> The bridge in between. Run must hate you. What did I do? You know what you did. I didn't do anything. You'll see it later. Right. But uh, you should. Uh, anyway. <laughs> Everybody knows. You yes. should see what um. You should, I'm interested. Well, guys, we got two more of these boys left. What is this? Bye, y'all. I love you. Bye. 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 I'm gonna be sad when this is over. Hey everyone, thanks for watching, and a big shout out to Luis, Joe Mag, Nasser, NYR fam, Smokeworm, Ruby, Christian, Sean, Allison, Edward, Nico, Browerhouse, Kelly Parks, and Keyboard Junkie. Thanks guys, we'll see you next week.